Vision is behind the making of runners. Praise the Lord. You're welcome to Wednesday, the 22nd day of April 2020. We're looking at wrong association, a limitation of destiny. Do not be deceived. Evil communications corrupt good manners. 1 Corinthians chapter 15, verse 33. Thought for the day. The wrong association is a limitation of destiny, just as the right association is a facilitator of destiny. A story was told of how a shepherd found a cub or a baby lion and took it to be nurtured in his sheepfold. The cub grew and thought it was a sheep. The cub ate grass and moved along with the sheep. Once in a while, a big lion would come to pursue the sheep. While the sheep ran for safety, the sheep lion or the sheepified lion would also run. One day, the cub saw his face in the water and he was shocked. It ran back again, thinking it was that big lion that was coming out of the water. It tried several times and realized that it was his own face that he saw in the water. On another occasion, the bigger lion came again, pursuing the sheep as usual. While the sheep ran, the cub decided not to run. When the bigger lion saw the cub, he picked the cub and played with it and took it from the sheepfold to the lion's territory. He became one of the members of the company of the lions. He joined in learning to roar and to tear flesh. That cub had a great potential as a lion, but he was limited by certain factors. It would have died as a sheep with the potential of a lion if it was not rescued. In the same way, there are many people who have great potentials in life, but are limited by certain factors. In the case of the cub, in our study today, it was a wrong association that limited its destiny. The wrong association is a limitation of destiny, just as the right association is a facilitator of destiny. Beloved, I don't know what is, it is that is limiting your destiny, but I decree that you are rising up in victory today in the name of Jesus. Remember this, the wrong association is a limitation of destiny, just as the right association is a facilitator of destiny. Praise the Lord. What's our assignment? Number one, make up your mind to disconnect from the wrong association. Number two, connect with the right association that will facilitate your destiny. Praise the Lord. Let's pray. Say after me, Lord, I ask for what, I ask that you will connect me with what is the right association that will facilitate my destiny fulfillment. I receive the grace to disconnect from every wrong association. In Jesus' name, amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. There is, there's somebody listening to me today and one of your greatest problems is that you, are, you have wrong associations. Your friends introduced you to alcohol or tobacco or womanizing or pornography. And today you're hooked and you want to say, Pastor, pray for me. I want to be free from this limitation. I want to be born again. Simply pray this after me. Say, Lord Jesus, thank you for dying for my sins. I know I'm a sinner. I need your help. Jesus, please come into my life and be the Lord of my life. Wash away all my sins and make me a new person. In Jesus' name, amen. Praise the Lord. God bless you. Have a wonderful day. Place of revival. It is a place of.